Okay, so this is the hoodie. It's an old hoodie from an old friend of mine. And um, I see, you guys see the oil stain right there. I just wasted some Vaseline. It was hot and it was loose. And it wasted on my hoodie. But we're not going to go there right now. So, yeah, this is the hoodie we're going to be transforming to a spaghetti strap dress. So, first things first, we're going to start off by cutting out the hoodie, the actual hoodie itself, and all the other components. So, I'm going to cut out the hoodie first. And then you're going to later see me time lapse me cutting off the sleeves and all that rada rada, you know, rada rada. <laughs> And so after I cut off the sleeves, I am going to start cutting um, the sides. Because basically, I'm going to need two front panels to sew together for the spaghetti strap dress. So um, you see me like pulling it out and stuff. Because the jacket has pockets, so I had to cut the pockets out as well. And it was just so, like, it was so frustrating with those scissors. Because those are not my fabric shears. It's just some random scissors at the house. And they were not sharp enough whatsoever. Like, oh my God. Like, cutting the end part right there. Like, that rip, that sweater material it was so hard but now you just see me cut out like the squares and i'm making like the back and the front even okay and so now you're just seeing me cut out the actual panels itself i know you now see the black on top of the part that says trap life but that's because um i needed some extra room. and i was just lazy and didn't feel like cutting the rib that's why i said extra ribbon at the bottom like that sweater material but now you i'm gonna have to do a fold it over and do a straight stitch across the top just to clean up those raw edges and then again i'm just showing you i'm lazy don't worry about that part yeah, i could have cut it but i decided not to but let's not go there let's not go there but anywho like i said we're going to fold this over and do a straight stitch across the top of the um hoodie to you know clean up those raw edges and right here i'm just showing you on the machine i take one panel you know fold it over so straight stitch across and we're going to do the same with the other if you guys didn't understand what i was saying when i was saying like clean up the raw edges i'm just showing you guys you see how i fold it over and just stitch straight across the top and you're going to repeat the steps with the other side so yeah So now we're just going to match up the two panels right side facing right side. So like, you know, like as if it was inside out. And yeah, we're just going to, you know, match those up, you know, like, you know, match them up. <laughs> and so after that, we're going to, since it is like a more of a stretch material, I'm going to take a zigzag stitch and sew straight down the sides. Now, um, for some people, if you do have like cur like a curvy shape, you would curve it in and give yourself some little hip dips. Not hip dips, but like, you know, like dip it in on the side for the curves. This was off like the sleeves part and this is actually just like per the perfect length for my strap. So I'm going to cut it like so with the red and white around it and then connect it like, you know, like sew it together or whatever. So I have like a red, black, and white strap, you know? Um, I'm gonna show you guys once I sew them together. My um, what they call it? My um, my, oh, my tripod fell. Did that? So, yeah. I, um, my camera actually, well, my phone died or whatever, but I was already sewing and I was in the zone. So I just sewed the straps on where I wanted the straps to be at. And that was it. And my dress was basically completed after that. So yeah. Okay, so this is the dress. Um, this is me with it without a bra on, and I really like it. Um, I keep saying um a lot, but yeah, like I'm just gonna show you guys the dress. Gonna turn around and show you how it looks in the back. It's really it's on the short side, but it's really snug, and I like it a lot. And I'm gonna wear it with probably like some red, black, and white fives or something like that. But definitely love it. And I didn't show you guys the straps, but I'm just showing you guys that I just sewed it on with the straight stitch across. And that's about it for the most part. It's really simple. It's just two panels. Sew the two panels together, then add the straps, and boom, bow, you're done. And I was saying I might take it in some more on the sides. I'm not sure yet because it is pretty tight. So, you know, I don't know. Um, but I love it. If you guys enjoyed this video, <laughs> like, comment, and subscribe. Whoa. I was waiting on that part right there. <laughs>
but bye YouTube.